Tom, a 3 0 defeat goes without saying. Tough day at the office. Yeah, tough. Uh, very disappointing from ourselves. Um, I think we know we weren't. Uh, well, I don't think we started the game obviously as well as last week, but then I feel we had like a 20, 25 minute period in the first half where you felt like something was coming. Um, and then obviously it's the old cliche the worst time to concede, but it's. <laughs> You know, it's a good free kick. You stuck it in. Sometimes you you hold your hands up and say, you know, you can't do much about it. It's a, it's a good finish. Um, and yeah, in the second half again, I think two good goals. I don't really think they've created much else no. apart from them two. And you know, I think like you say, one of them days, unfortunately. So good for half an hour, going a goal down. Do you feel a sense of injustice at that point? Um, I, I don't think injustice. No, I think like our. Oh, I still think we had some good spells, but also some some sloppy spells where we give the ball away a bit too easily. Um, but I think we were, you could say, a bit unlucky to come in one 0 down. Like I say, it was a great free kick, and you know he he could probably do that one uh, a few times. Or you know what I'm trying to say. Um, but yeah, like I say, it's a great finish. We, we we came in feeling okay at our time, thinking you know we just go out in the second half and and get the next goal and then straight back in the game. But like I say, they scored a second and third, two and three very good goals as well. Yeah. Where was the reaction from a Doncaster Rovers point of view after half time? I, I think we came out pretty positive. Like I say, we, or uh, well, from what I can remember, I felt pretty in control. Nothing really troubling us. Um, and then uh, I think Erste got dispossessed of the ball and he's out wide and it's, it's a great strike again from the lads so still mistakes from us but there's still a chance to, to stop the ball going in the back of the net so it, it, again it's disappointing but you know it's a great finish from the lad. I was going to say because it didn't feel like they were going for the kill and, and, and trying to you know did you sense there was a kind of vulnerability within them them being bottom of the league and holding on to a, a slender advantage? Well I think you know before the game kicked off we we watched the game last week when they played crew and they should have won that game um, so we knew it weren't going to be easy I think their position in the league doesn't do them justice to how they've been especially the last few games um, they've got some good players as we've seen today and you know, we came knowing that this was going to be a tough game, um, and unfortunately, we've got a long trip back now. A bit disappointed in ourselves, really.